<laughs> beautiful gates opening up. The gates to heaven, if you want to call them that, while we're down here on earth anyway. Man, it's great that you came out today. We want to try to show you a little bit of uh, what we do out here at the Sundown Stables. Uh, this facility does not belong to Broken Arrow, but it's where we keep some of our horses at, so just to let you know. And I'm sure that you're going to have a great time when you come out, all right? So I just want you to follow me when you get a chance. How about that? <laughs> Talk to you later. I'd like to welcome you to the Broken Arrow Horseback Riding Club website. I want to first of all just thank you for just popping up and, and uh, checking us out. It's been a wonderful 27 years going on, our 28th year right now. And I want to just give you a little information about Broken Arrow. We started back on January the 15th, 1989, which was Martin Luther King's birthday. We didn't even realize that that was the day that we were starting on, but it was that day. And I wanted to establish an organization that stood for peace. And I knew that the broken arrow was a symbolic symbol of an Indian breaking an arrow, meaning peace. Well, that's what took place. Uh, we established the name Broken Arrow, which meant peace. Then finally realizing that we also established ourselves on the day of Martin Luther King's birthday, another person who stood for peace. And then I went to Salem Baptist Church, what they call the greatest church in the world in Chicago. And Salem stood for peace, so that was a trinity. So I knew I was heading in the right direction. But that was just the start. When I first came home from the military from Vietnam, I wanted to bring horseback riding back to the inner city of Chicago. It's been a struggle, still haven't been able to uh, achieve that challenge as of yet because of the, uh, the different uh, aspects of what takes place in the city politics. Who knows, but hopefully uh, one day that that will prevail. But in the meantime, this is our 27th year right now as of uh, 19, well it's not 19, but uh, 2016. And we've been doing wonders in the uh, city. Uh, hopefully you'll look at some of the videos that we have and some of the pictures that we've established and placed on the uh, internet here on our website so you can see what it is that we're about. We would like for you to become a part of Broken Arrow as one of our associate members. You can also see the core members pictures on our website right now. But I being the founder of this organization, the longest uh, organization has been established in Chicago right now since its inception. Uh, what we do is to try to bring peace and harmony to other organizations that's in the city here. Also to the point that we just like to try to bring information to the city about cowboys and uh, the history in reference to that. Also to the point that we do a couple events throughout the year. We do an event uh, which is normally held in the first or either the second Sunday of June, which is held at the South Shore Culture Center in Chicago where we do what we call a Speed in Action Rodeo Horse Show. Some people know it as a gaming show or either so much as a Jim Connor show. Then we also do the event uh, called the High Noon Ride and Picnic, which has placed us on a map, where we have horse riders that come from far east as Philadelphia, from far west as uh, Vegas, Nevada rather, and uh, Oklahoma, different places like Indiana, Wisconsin, Ohio. Uh, they've come from Tennessee. You name it, they've been there to see us. And we just welcome all and thank all of those people that have taken an opportunity to uh, participate with us to make our venture even a little bit bigger than what I could have ever even imagined. I'd like to just thank those people here in Chicago specifically that have supported us, that have helped us and uh, given us their help in trying to bring to each year the events that we do. I'd like to just thank the people in the city that have allowed us to do the things that we do. And so now, just to tell you about Broken Earl, We've done things initially. We started out trying to give to Laura B. the Children's Hospital and Research Center, where we would try to generate and raise money to give to an organization that where they took in children who could not afford to pay for health care themselves. So we did what we could do to do our part. So that was our first goal. Then from that standpoint on, we tried to just generate and bring other people into our organization as associate members. Uh, you can read other information on the website that can tell you how you can become a part of Broken Arrow. And we certainly hope that you'll uh, cherish that opportunity and actually take advantage of it. Also, we try to generate and work with younger children to uh, do at our events. Well, we give 100 cowboy hats away each year uh, to the kids that come free of charge to them just for the first 100 cowboys that show up with their children. And we thank all of those that come out each and every single year. We've never been rained on or rained out in the 27 years that we've had our events at uh, Washington Park during the High Noon Ride and Picnic, and we hope that that continues as a tribute to us for doing what we do. So here again, we just thank you for uh, participating with us. We want to try to continuously work with the city in hopes that they will eventually allow us to have this riding stable at 59th and Cottage Grove. 
What do we plan to do there? We plan to uh, teach equestrianship, uh, people how to uh, uh, ride, how to train horses, how to become a horse farrier, how to become a veterinarian's assistant. We have the University of uh, uh, Chicago right next to us, the hospital there, that they could assist us with these things as well. But it will give kids a great opportunity. You've never seen a horseback ride drive-by shooting, as we call it. And so we try to change their attitudes in such that ways that they take seriously what we try to do by uh, uh, bringing involving children in with the horses. But we don't want to just take children in unless their parents are going to welcome to come with them as well. So just to let you know, you can reach us at the number that's going to be listed before, 773-684-8588. Our website is also listed at the bottom, as you've already located us by coming on to this. So we thank you once again, and, and once and for all, we just hope that you'll become a part. If not, make a donation to help us for our worthy cause, so that we can continuously do this. And then, of course, we also have been dealing with the Bud Belkin Parade for several years, which is the largest black parade in the city of Chicago, as well as local parades. We travel in and out of the city going to various rodeos, and some of us compete, some of us don't, but we do go there to participate as well as to uh, support. So won't you give us your support once again to the Broken Arrow Horseback Riding Club of Chicago. And finally, let me leave you with this famous word, yee <laughs> You take care. Thanks for tuning in.